This video was made possible by the Content Creator Program. An MCOC champion is temporarily granted to select accounts for the purpose of allowing the community a first look at a new champion coming to the contest. All granted champions are removed from accounts before they are officially released to the community. Hey everyone, Shadow here, and welcome to my first content creator program video. So this champion here, Sunspot, was given to me for the purposes of creating a video such as this one. Uh, you already heard what the content creator program is about. This champion will not stay on my account. Uh, in fact, this champion will be leaving my account tomorrow. Uh, we had a very short turnaround time for this particular champion. I got him on the 6th of August, and he will be leaving my account on the 8th of August. All right, so we've got this rank 3 SIG 200 Sunspot. Uh, that is because I'm Cavalier. If I was not, I believe they get the 4-star version. Let's take a look at his attributes real quick here. Remember, it is a rank 3. And this is our first look at Sunspot. So you can see the tags. You can take a look at his attributes, switch over here. All right, um, that block proficiency is better than quite a few other champions. Uh, and we'll talk about his uh, block proficiency in a moment. And here are his synergy bonuses. Now, I looked over these and I wasn't really all that excited about them. Maybe I'm missing something, but they didn't seem all that powerful to me. Nothing really excited me about these, but showing them to you here. Now this may change. Remember, this is just my first look at the champion. And later when I actually get the champion myself uh, in the arena, then we'll do a closer look video once I've ranked him up and we'll go more in depth uh, about his abilities. But I wanted to take a look just briefly over his abilities and what it looks like to me is everything revolves around his solar charges and flare state now he's incinerate immune and he does incinerates while he's in that flare state okay and the solar charges as you can see max is 80 um but the flare state max is 10. you can also reset them let's take a look further on um but you can reset them when you fire off a special three all right now on well-timed blocks that's when you you know do your parry uh you will get a 100 percent perfect block chance but that is as long as the opponent is incinerated, okay? And you can see here the different specials. Now, with his special attacks, uh, what it looks like you wanna do is you wanna fire off a special attack one, you build up your flare state, you wanna kinda manage them, uh, and we'll talk about that a little bit later uh, in the gameplay portion, uh, but the special three allows you to reset it. If you don't reset it and you run out, it starts back over at zero and you're not in flare state and you're going to end up losing a lot of damage. All right. So that is pretty much it. Let's take a look real quick here. You can see his signature ability. Um, so at SIG 200, uh, he increases his maximum number of solar charges by 40. So that can be a nice, I don't know whether he needs to be awakened or not. Uh, but let's go over to the gameplay. We're going to take him into Realm of Legends, and I'll talk to you a little bit more about what I'm doing in there and my thoughts on the champion. All right, so the first thing I want to talk about is the team I decided to go in here with. I did not decide to use any of Sunspot's synergies. I just wasn't impressed. So I went in with a mutant crit team. I don't know if that's the best team to support him, but it gives a lot of attack, um, mutant special attack, and... Uh, crit crit damage all right so 
let's jump right on in here. Now, I want you to notice his flare state and the solar charges. He started with 120 because of his SIG level. All right, now watch this. I'm gonna fire off the uh, special one. And once I hit him with that, you'll see that the flare state went up to two. So the more you have, the harder your special two is going to hit. And you'll also notice that the solar charges are diminishing with every hit. But Winter Soldier is also getting incinerated with every hit. Okay, now to reset that, you want to fire off a special three. So I'm down to 49 right now. So watch what happens. We got our special three here. And you will see that it resets. Now the thing to note, and it's a, a juggling act, is with each hit, it's gonna diminish the solar charges by the amount of flare state. So right now, flare state is two. So that's why you see it going down by two every time I hit him. So the higher your flare state, the quicker you're gonna start losing those solar charges, okay? Uh, so I'm just showing you guys the specials uh, and I don't find this champion to be very suicide friendly. Okay, uh, what it looks like you wanna do is build up your flare state and when you fire off that special two, you're gonna get a prowess buff that's gonna increase your attack by 200% per flare state. So he can do a lot of damage. We're not gonna see that in this particular fight but I wanted to mention it and we'll probably explore that in detail when I do a closer look video later. But you got a chance to see the damage that he is capable of. Now, one of the weaknesses that I see in him right off is if he's going up against someone who is incinerate immune, he's gonna have a bad day, all right? But if they're not incinerate immune, then he's actually going to do quite a bit of damage. Now, he is a ramp up champion. And I didn't do a lot of ramp up. Now you see here, that's the special two. Just look at that damage, okay? And before the fight is over, we're going to uh, fire off another one. But look at the flare state, which is non-existent right now, and the solar charges, which are at zero. In order for me to get flare state back, I've got to fire off a special three because I allowed them to expire. So it's a juggling act and it becomes harder and harder the more flare states uh, you have. Okay, so here I'm firing off my special three so that I can get a reset on my solar charges and flare state. And then I believe I'm going to fire off another special two so you can compare it to the damage that you saw earlier as well. I believe I'm gonna do that, I'm not sure. It's been a little bit since I uh, did the recording and I had to do it pretty quickly. All right, and there we go. So I'm, I have flare state two. And again, each hit is putting an incinerate on him. Okay, and that's it. All right, so that is the fight. It's not the best way to use him. He is ramp up champion. Uh, when you charge his heavy, he purifies, incinerates on the opponent. Uh, so there's a lot to talk about when we do our closer look. But overall, I think this is a very interesting champion. I like his animations. And he has a lot of damage potential. Now, me personally, I am not the biggest fan of ramp up champions. I don't like having to take the time to build them up for them to do the good damage. But overall, for a ramp up champion, I think he's pretty good. He's not suicide friendly. Uh, so that would minimize his usefulness to anyone who is deciding, like I am, to run suicides all the time. But he's actually pretty good. I don't know where I would use him at this point in time, uh, but he seems like he could be quite useful. All right, so that's gonna do it, guys. Thank you for watching. 
my first video from the content creator program. Hopefully you enjoyed it. Click like, subscribe, leave a comment. Let me know what you thought about this video. And you all have a blessed day.